today, the city of West brought home a World War II soldier and laid him to rest after years of uncertainty. Fox 44's Mally Jones attended today's service and spoke with the family about what this means to them. Hundreds of people in the community showed up today for Louis Girard. I mean, most of them never even met. We just uh, always heard about him. I'm so happy for this family that um, they got to see him return home. It's a very emotional and beautiful thing. Closure for the family of a soldier killed during World War II, finally bringing him home after nearly 80 years. It's just, it just fills my heart with love to know that this has been done. Lewis Gerard is from West Texas. He was serving as the co-pilot of a B-24 Liberator aircraft. It crashed August 1st, 1943, after being hit by enemy anti-aircraft fire during Operation Tidal Wave. It's a very emotional time. Beautiful, just beautiful. I appreciate whatever, whoever did to uh, have this to happen. In 2017, the DPAA began exhuming unknowns they thought were associated with Operation Tidal Wave and examining them. Gerard was accounted for on March 28th this year. It's nothing short of a miracle that he was identified nearly 80 years after being lost in combat in World War II. I'd like to express our sincere gratitude the Army for never giving up in their mission to return Lewis home. Samuel Kim says they don't leave the fallen behind no matter how long it's been. The country is willing to go above and beyond even after over 80 years trying to find, find everyone and bring them home. Mally Jones, Fox 44 News.